hello coders in this video i am going to explain you resize function so please concentrate numpy dot resize and array dot resize numpy dot resize function is used to create a new array with a specified shape which is almost same for the array dot resize array dot resize is also used to create a new array with a specified shape now if the new array is larger than the original array then the new array is filled with the repeated copies of the elements from the array now array dot resize so if you are using array dot resize if the new array is larger than the original array then the new elements is filled with the zero next as i said if the new array is larger than the original array then the new array is filled with the repeated copies of the elements if you are using numpy dot resize that you can see in the example left side i have imported numpy as np then i have created one d array with a range function then np dot resize i have passed the x then phi cos 3 that you can see elements which is filled with 1 0 0 which is filled with the repeated copies of the elements from the array now array dot resize so if the new array is larger than the original array then the new array is filled with the zeros that you can see resize phi cos 3 so here you can see 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 10 9 same number of elements but remaining because here total we are having the 10 elements but we want to create the 2d array with size 15 elements 5 cross 3 so here it filled with the zeros but here it is filled with the repeated copies of the elements this is the difference between numpy dot resize and array dot resize now next np dot resize not change the original array while array dot resize change the original array which is called in place operation remember this i am repeating numpy dot resize not change the original array it will first create the copy of the array then it will perform the resize but array dot resize change the original array it will not create the copy of it which is called as a in place operation that you can see over here if number of elements that you pass in the resize which is less compared to the array that you have created now you can see the example on the left side i have created the array 1d array with np dot a range which contain 10 elements but when you give np dot resize only you provided 2 cross 3 means 6 elements so here no problem right so it will consider for 6 elements and create a 2d array which is same for the array dot resize so if you pass less number of elements in the resize then it will consider the elements accordingly that you can see over here on the right side so again i have created one d array with 10 elements with np dot array but here array dot resize i have passed 2 comma 3 2 rows 3 columns total 6 elements no problem it will consider for 6 elements let i show you this practically in the jupyter notebook now let me import numpy as np so here i am going to show you if the new array is larger than original array the new array is filled with the repeated copies of elements from the array if you are using numpy dot resize if you are using array dot resize so if the new array is larger than the original array the new array is filled with the zeros so let me create first np dot a range 1d array with 10 elements now let i take the variable v dot np dot resize with x that i want to reshape with phi cross 3 now you can see if the new array is larger than the original array the new array is filled with the repeated copies of elements from the array that you can see here 1 2 3 4 5 now array dot resize let me copy this one now directly x dot resize phi cross 3 now you can see here in array dot resize 
if the new array is larger than the original array, the new array filled with the zeros that you can see here. Now next, np dot resize not change the original array. Now np dot resize again x with phi cross three. Now you can see also x as it is. So np dot resize not change the original array. First it will create the copy of the array, then perform the resize operation. Now array dot resize. So let me first assign it to v x dot resize array dot resize phi cross three. It will print nothing because array dot resize change the original array which is called as in place operation. Now you can see the x. So original array is converted into the phi cross three. What if we are using resize with the less number of elements? So let I take v np dot resize with let I am passing x over here. Then just two three cross two, right? So here I am using the ten elements created one D array with ten elements, but here. We are using resize with only six elements, three cross two, no problem. So it will create or resize the array with three rows and two columns by just taking zero, one, two, three, four, five, six elements. Thank you. Thank you for watching.